During uh, COVID, we have had to become very creative in the way we deliver education, um, have meetings, as well as any other types of interaction amongst the residents and between the attendings and the residents. This has been both good and bad. Of course, we miss those uh, live in-person interactions, uh, but at the same time, uh, sometimes those uh, live in-person interactions were difficult to implement. For instance, we have residents that are at various different hospitals and could not necessarily come back to home base here in Boston for a conference. Now with Zoom lectures, we're able to have much greater participation. This has uh, segued into a whole different way that we have administered our core lectures to our residents, which are now done uh, completely virtually. We have also um, instituted a virtual method of educating our interns for what's called boot camp. Boot camp was a large module uh, that took, over, uh, took place over a month in which there was a combination of lectures as well as in-person, hands-on, basic orthopedic skill uh, education and teaching. In the quarantine, of course, we could not have any in-person meetings. So having some type of saw bones or live demonstration of how to put a screw or where to put a screw or how to hold a drill was no longer feasible. What uh, our group did, led by our uh, overall program director, George Dyer, and one of our uh, graduating superstar residents uh, last year, uh, developed a virtual boot camp. In addition to the lectures, we developed a low cost, uh, easily accessible group of instruments, tools, and materials, such as wooden blocks, screws from the hardware store, a power drill, and various other objects and devices that simulated what we use in the operating room and guided our interns through various different activities so that they can learn and be prepared for their first year officially of orthopedics in their second year of residency. This has allowed people to not only attend lectures locally, but just last week we had a grand rounds, a special lecture given by one of our, by one of our faculty, and we had people attend from all around the world. This has really forever changed uh, medical education, and this will forever change both the spine fellowship education and the residency education. I was invited to uh, be a panelist at a uh, worldwide discussion. We had one panelist from New York, one panelist from Switzerland, and then myself in Boston. We were all up at the same time uh, presenting and discussing live uh, through online platforms. This truly is a paradigm change in education and in the exchange of knowledge.